For more videos on people's struggles, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. More than 10,000 children have been killed or injured in war-torn Yemen, according to a statement released on October 20th by UNICEF. Latest UN figures state that a total of 3,455 children were killed and more than 6,600 wounded in the fighting in Yemen between March 2015 and September 2021. Terming it a shameful milestone, UNICEF spokesperson James Elder said that the figure amounts to four children dying or being wounded every day in the Yemen conflict. Today, UNICEF has stated that we have surpassed 10,000 Yemeni children killed or injured. The question must be asked, do we need to continue to add children to this miserable list day after day, month after month, year after year? Yemen is the most difficult place in the world to be a child. Incredulously, it's getting worse. Yemen's humanitarian crisis, the world's worst, represents the tragic convergence of four main factors, a violent and protracted conflict, economic devastation, social services on the brink of collapse, that's health, nutrition, water, sanitation, education, protection, and a critically underfunded UN system. Now, at current funding levels and without an end to fighting, UNICEF simply cannot reach all these children. Uh, there's no way to say this simply. Without international support, more children, those who bear absolutely no responsibility for this conflict, will die. The bottom line is children in Yemen are starving because adults continue to wage a war in which children are the biggest losers. The statement noted that four out of every five children are in need of humanitarian assistance, which is estimated to be around 11 million children. 400,000 children suffer from severe acute malnutrition and more than two million are out of school. Another four million are at risk of dropping out. Almost two-thirds of all the teachers in the country have not received salaries for over four years, a direct result of the Yemeni economy collapsing due to the war. Since 2015, the GDP of the country fell by over 40 percent. Overall, the number of people who don't have regular access to safe water, sanitation, and hygiene has crossed 15 million, according to UN data. More than 80 percent of the population approximately 20 million, is now dependent on international humanitarian aid for day-to-day -day survival. An estimated 4 million of them are internally displaced. These factors have contributed immensely to the rising death toll in the country, which has already crossed 230,000. The war in Yemen began in 2014 after the Houthis took over much of the north of the country, including capital Sana'a and drove out the Western and Saudi-backed Yemeni government. The war took a deadlier turn with the Saudi-led Gulf Coalition's military intervention in Yemen in March 2015. Indiscriminate airstrikes launched into Yemen by the coalition, many of them on heavily civilian populated areas, caused massive death and destruction. Of the approximately 22,000 air and drone strikes, many ended up targeting and demolishing schools, hospitals, refugee camps, and factories, and killed thousands of Yemeni civilians.